this is the circuit diagram to interface raindrop sensor with node MCU ESP8266. Uh, this is raindrop sensor module. Uh, it has got two pins plus and minus. So these two are internally connected in the model. And uh, four pins v uh, VCC, ground, uh, digital pin and analog pin. And you can use analog pin or you can use digital pin. If you are using analog pin, you have to write uh, an analog read. The send uh, command or uh, uh, Arduino command you have to use. If you are using a, a D0 pin, so you have to write the command digital read. So the VCC of uh, raindrop sensor is connected to VCC of node MCU. Ground of uh, uh, raindrop sensor is connected to ground of node MCU. And uh, D0 of uh, rain, uh, raindrop sensor, it is connected to uh, D2 pin of node MC. This is about circuit diagram. Uh, here I am using raindrop sensor. Uh, see these two are connected. Plus of, uh, plus of this is connected to the first pin and the negative is connected to the second pin. And uh, it has got four pins. Uh, A0, uh, D0 and a VCC and a ground. Uh, VCC of uh, raindrop sensor is connected to VCC of node MCU. Ground of raindrop sensor is connected to ground of mm, node MCU. And uh, here I am using digital pin and the digital pin of uh, raindrop sensor is connected to D2 pin of node MCU because in program I am using D2. So after downloading the program and um, in serial monitor, I will show you the result. Now, uh, the uh, raindrop sensor is completely dry. There is no water drop on that. So, what it will uh, show in a serial monitor, I will see you uh, show you now. Uh, look in the uh, serial monitor. No rain detected. Enjoy the weather. So, because there is no rain drop on the sensor. Now, I will uh, uh, put some water on the raindrop uh, sensor and what result we will get we will check it now okay now i'll pour some water on this okay so now you check the serial monitor rain detected take over so when i add some when i pour some water on the raindrop sensor so it is sensing so it is giving the message rain detected take over again i'll dry it and what result i'll get get i'll show you so when there is no uh, rain water drop on the sensor module and it is give, displaying the message no rain detected enjoy the weather a raindrop sensor is also known as a rain sensor or a rain detector uh, it is a device designed to detect the presence of rain or moisture it is commonly used in applications such as um, automatic windshield uh, wipers in a vehicle and uh, rain triggered irrigation system The sensor, uh, the sensor has a surface or a substrate uh, that is usually made of uh, material that conducts electricity. See, this is a copper uh, uh, plate, and uh, it is made uh, made of material that conducts electricity, and it is capable of holding electrical charge. And there are two conductive traces or electrodes on the sensor surface. There are two electrodes here. Okay, uh, uh, they are arranged in a way that they are parallel. Uh, they are parallel, and these traces are connected to the electronic circuit. So, in dry condition, uh, there is no rain or moisture on the uh, sensor surface. So, here there will be no moisture. It, it is completely dr uh, dry. Uh, so, the electrical resistance between the two conductive uh, traces is very very high. And this means that there is a uh, limited or no electrical conductivity between the uh, traces. Uh, 
therefore no current flows when raindrop or moisture um, comes in contact with this sensor uh, they create conductive path between um, two uh, traces water because water is a good conductor of electricity so it reduces the uh, resistance between the traces so as more raindrop accumulate on the sensor surface the conductivity increases and the measurable current starts to flow between the traces okay so in this way the current flows in the circuit the raindrop sensors are simply uh, effective devices uh, they use uh, changes in electrical conductivity uh, to detect the presence of air or a moisture air or a moisture Uh, in this program, uh, the raindrop sensor pin uh, that is connected to D, D2 pin of uh, node MCU. And uh, in wide setup, we are initializing the serial monitor uh, with a baud rate of 115200 because we want to display uh, send a message uh, whether rain uh, is uh, detected or uh, no rain detected. Uh, for that purpose, I am using uh, serial monitor. And the raindrop sensor pin, what we have defined here, I'm making this as an input pin uh, because uh, it will uh, sense the uh, uh, rain, whether uh, rain is uh, detected or not. And the, uh, for that purpose, we I am making this pin as an input pin. And uh, in wide loop, uh, we are reading the raindrop sensor pin using digital read and uh, uh, storing the uh, result in a raindrop state. So uh, it may give high or a low. Uh, so check whether the raining sensor is wet or dry. If the raindrop sensor uh, state is low, uh, then uh, we say that rain, uh, rain detected and to uh, take over. So this message will be printed, uh, displayed on a, a serial monitor. And uh, after that, uh, some delay is given, 10 seconds of uh, delay is given. Mm, then else, uh, no rain detected. Uh, so if there is no rain, uh, if it is completely dry, it will uh, display a message, uh, no rain detected and enjoy the weather. So again, uh, after that, uh, I am giving uh, 30, uh, 30 milliseconds of uh, delay. Uh, so in this way, uh, we are uh, checking whether the rain is detected or not. So when we read the state of the uh, rain, uh, raindrop sensor, uh, when it is uh, dry, when there is no rain, uh, it, the sensor will give a high reading. And uh, uh, when it is wet, the sensor will give a uh, low reading. So based on that, we will send a message.